Relaxing? You call this relaxing? What? The aroma, the steam. It's like I'm being transported to another plane. It's all very zen, if you ask me. It doesn't seem very zen to me. You sure you don't want some? And that's okay. You ever look at a cup of tea? What's that? Sure, plenty of times. Why? What do you see? Well, I see water. I see some loose leaves that slip through. And some sugar that hasn't quite dissolved yet. Why? You know what I see? What's that? I see the ancient mysteries of China, the enchantment of India. See, very sad. I also see the subjugation of native peoples across multiple continents. Oh. I see a Western addiction to tea, which has fueled wars of conquest that have dragged on for centuries. I see the East India Company. I see exploitation and empire. I see imperialism and commercialism. I see colonization and globalization. Colonization. I see taxation and revolution. I see Boston Harbor dark with an axe of vandalism and, and patriotism. I see sons of liberty and the daughters of the American Revolution. I see John Locke. I see Montesquieu. I see Thomas Jefferson himself. I see the tyranny of kings. I see the new world rising up against the old. I see liberty itself. See, that's not so bad then. <laughs> oh, well, I also see British colonels in their khaki and their pith helmets riding on elephants while their subjects labor in the noonday sun to clear the forests of India and Ceylon just so their European overlords can wring out more profit. You may look in that cup of tea and see peace and harmony with the universe, but all I see is death and war and misery for millions. All that in there. And more! <laughs> wow. <laughs>